in regards to my last TF2 video telling you to stay away from TF2, the TF team actually remembered their Twitter password and have actually given us, you know, a bit of an update regarding today's reported leak of code, specifically as it pertains to TF2. This also appears to be related to the code depots released to partners in late 2017 and originally leaked in 2018. From our view, we have not found any reason for TF2 players to be alarmed or avoid the current builds in brackets, as always playing on the official servers as greatly recommended for security. We will continue to investigate the situation and will update news outlets and players if we find anything to prove otherwise. In the meantime, if anyone has more information about this leak, visit the Valve security page. Basically, TF2 is fine, um, play on official Valve servers for the meanwhile if you want to be safe. I know community servers are like the backbone of the TF2 community and I'm not saying they're not safe, but as Valve have said here, stick to official servers for now, just to be on the safe side. I didn't mean to create any panic with the last video, but I just wanted to make sure people were you know, aware of the situation and they could handle it the way they saw fit. So yeah, it might have been a bit, ooh, don't do this. And I really thought, you know, it might be the best course of action just in case there is any issue with TF2. Turns out it was fine, but it's best to be on the safe side. So yeah, go enjoy TF2.